Oh my god. So loud. They're having sex with other people, but not, not with each other. Wait, who? Okay, good. You're not having sex. <laughs> Nobody's having sex. Nobody's having sex with beef, and Lisa's having, I don't know, sex with somebody. Oh yeah, you never know with me. You deviated. Oh, damn it, pause. Ruin it for Milby, for me, me and Milby forever now. Mm-hmm. Oh my god. I love that. I'm lost. It's like I've entered a new world. <laughs> <laughs> Milby, now you're in a love square with beef paws, you, and now female you. <laughs> yes! So when they say, I love Milby, you don't know who they're talking about. And don't forget uh, about Bash. I mean, he does <laughs> have to shave his mustache. That's, that's like, a prerequisite. I know that this is a word. Prerequisite? Yes, that's the word. I know that's a prerequisite, but he has, after he shaves his mustache, he is also fair game. <laughs> uh... What a what a what a crazy Twitter time! People being just spammed with with Twitter messages. Yes. Oh yeah. wow. I had to retweet that. It made me laugh. Yes. <laughs> oh, so she God. did actually figure out who you are then. Yeah, she's got. She's clicked on my. I've got my if you click on my name, I've got the link mm. to the. Uh... I give anything to be a YouTube celebrity. <laughs> made me laugh. I'm pretty sure that's sarcasm. So she's already. She's already admiring you now. Like, so hey, that's hey, baby, very... you can. Uh... That's right, you can you can ride on my coattails, come along. Be you can be YouTube oh. E fame minor E fame. Yeah, Milby, has uh, it, it's been a while since you've been on the wagon. The lady wagon at least. Is it uh it, is coattails is that a euphemism? Oh, it's in like coattails, just mean you know, riding on the coattails is in just right on the back of someone's someone else's success, something like that, you know. Yeah. Oh And not like no, actually riding on on his back, which no, I was more thinking about riding on his front. Yeah, I was just say, like, if you're running through, there's not, unless they've got, like, some sort of weird items. I don't know. Items? Yeah, I don't know. Something to make that work, like a saddle, or. I think I should tweet her <laughs> that I don't recommend riding his euphemismic coattails because he doesn't shave them. <laughs> you... Ever again. Oh my god. You're obsessed with this whole pube shaven. No, no, not obsessed. I'm just I'm just distressed is the word probably. Son of a bitch! <laughs> That's great. At Milby should start Minecraft LPs and then co op with Milby full. It's just <laughs> I do it. I'm trying to register with the secret world, and some asshole already still pause and pause. What? No, seriously. That's yeah. that's the problem. When people, when you get like more up and up, people are gonna start nicking your name, and then they're gonna try and pretend to be you, which is really <laughs> weird. But nicking your name just sounds so interesting in American English. Because I know hey. what you mean, but it's so it it it's it makes me giggle. It makes me giggle, yeah. It makes me giggle. It makes me feel. It makes me feel fuzzy inside. <laughs> That's a good question. Pause. Like, uh, G. I was just saying, does uh, Six Alonia know about this female Milby? 
Oh my god, I gotta get off. <laughs> oh god! <laughs> and did Where you see is... what one of her friends actually tweeted to her? This Brick Tamland. Oh, there's someone named Brick Tamland? That's a pretty awesome name. Yes! What's your name? Brick. Well, Brick and, and Tamland, what? His, he's at Mr. Michael I... Mr. Michael D. Jones is his Twitter, and he's fucking uh, he Michael to her just to be Alex Day, and then she replied, "Agreed, he is at the top." So you're always at the top, then? Pause. Wait, what? I just find this very. Is that is does he mean it's pause or much. does he mean? Oh, do you know any other Alexes? Quite Back. a few, actually. Funny enough, I was saying. I remember ages ago, I told Paul about this when he was. I was playing on Mario Kart uh, Seven on the 3DS, and someone joined the race who was Alex from Canada, and I was like, "Oh my God, it must be Paul." And I thought, "Wait, no, there's more than one Alex in Canada." <laughs> <laughs> oh, apparently she's a slut, though. Yes, Milby. What? I yeah. didn't say that. Why do you say that? Who because says she's one a of slut? her friends said, "Yeah, yeah, I'll be the one slut dropping on the dance floor," and then M Milby replied, "That's what I like to hear. We will have a slut drop dance off." Uh, that's probably yeah, 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 slut. slut dance off. Woo! <laughs> I'm already naked, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> I was, I got naked I totally pretty much the second too. this conversation started. I was born naked, naked all day. Oh, Only honey, closing me too. too. Oh baby. <laughs> Wait, you did you say you played you were trying to get on the secret world? I got I got into it, but I had to use pause and pause LP. It's a fucking prick. Uh is that, is that, is, to... that, is, that is that the Xbox one? You just need no, to no. be you just need like fake names. To hide your real names. Yeah, but then people are like, that's not really you, your name's not pause and pause. Or even on Twitch because I accidentally uh, signed up with a lowercase u. People are like, that's the fake pause and pause because the real pause and pause has a capital U. It's like, what? <laughs> really? Shut the fuck up. Really? Someone really? called you a fake pause and pause. Yeah. Wow. Okay, one second. I'm gonna try this pussy. It's fucking cold. You've gotta do a video. You should oh, do a God. video of that exact moment where someone says that yes. to you. And then be like, uh, <laughs> it was fun. <laughs> I want in the secret world. I do want in the secret world graveyard. I really want to try it out. It looks really fun. I won't. I thought it was on Xbox, so I didn't realize it was on PC. And now Twitch, Twitch names are stored case sensitive but they're not actually case sensitive in the chat because of how IRC functions because IRC is not case function or sensitive. In fact in early versions of IRC um, there were some sort of weird equivalents where um, and some of this is still in, in, in a place where like brackets are considered an uppercase version of parentheses. Weird I know. It's weird. Well, it has to do a lot with a. Uh, I think IRC was originally made in in Finland, and the and the characters they use in that spot are apparently uppercase versions of some weird derpy shit they use for their weird, inhuman fake languages. Gotta go to the toilet again. I'm my body's playing havoc with me right now. <laughs> right back. Yeah, it does capitalize the first letter. I think that's just the client, though. I don't think that's actually the, uh, the nope. server side stuff. Does it do that there, too? Um, actually, on my Merc, it gives me all lowercase for everyone, actually. Okay. And I registered with an upper with a uppercase L twice. Okay. And it only gives me one uppercase like in the beginning on the website itself because um what do I mean I forgot what I was gonna say 
It's okay. I forgot. I'm dying. My brain is 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 just leaking out of my ears right now. I'll I'll mop it up and preserve it for you. Oh, that's such a gross image, though, isn't it? Uh, it really is. Yeah, like mopping up do brain. Ew. <laughs> gross. This pussy tastes weird. Is it, is it tastes like mango <laughs> passion fruit? I don't know yes. what the fuck is in it. Pineapple, mango, passion fruit, and um. <laughs> is it the sloppy? Is it sloppy seconds for us? Probably. Is it, does it taste a little proteiny and a little sticky, a little milky? Tastes a couple days old. <laughs> oh boy! Oh, oh gross! <laughs> <laughs> and it's ice cold? Dude, I think you just you just had a dead pussy. I don't like it. <laughs> so wait, is it actually a drink called pussy? Yeah. I need send a link, please. I need to I need to look at the bottle. Is it give me one second I'll pull my tweet. Alright. Oh you tweeted it? Let me just pull yeah. up Twitter then. Twister. It says woohoo, I got some pussy sand in the mail. I haven't looked at my Twitter in 20 hours. Well, suffice it to, suffice it to say, I've tasted worse pussy. <laughs> oh, we've decided... Uh, because we asked Milby the same question, have you ever had any actual real-life male sexual encounters, Boz? No. Okay. I, I suspected that, but... Lisa was suspecting But are you are you straight or are you bisexual? I'd say I'm straight. I felt a butt. Uh, are you attacking pause on this now as well? I'm not attacking anyone. Seth, it's just I'm a pretty question. sure after being in a relationship for over four years and also having previous sex for multiple years after that, I can determine whether or not I am straight. We need to decide if you're straight or not. Is to if you've ever if you That's if you not... feel if you feel sexually attracted towards of a man. I yeah. can say whether mean, or not another guy looks have. good looking mean or not, don't but care. I don't have sexual feelings towards guys. Yeah, that's exactly what I said. I can appreciate when a man is like, I'm like the attractive man, he's handsome. But I'm not gonna be like, I wanna fuck that man. <laughs> I wanna, I wanna turn suck around, his dick. I wanna turn him around and I wanna bum him but since senseless. I wanna bugger him. I just stupid. wanna do it from behind while giving him a reach around. <laughs> <laughs> so many I just want to play the trumpet. I want to play the trumpet and just go crazy. Play the ask, trumpet ask and, blast, and go ask crazy. Blast crazy. Ask blast crazy. So yeah, many that, highlights. It's just highlights. amazing. Yeah, this 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 would be a very weird conversation to just sort of drop into a stream on. You'd be like, oh, the show Final Fantasy V. I love this game. And then it comes in, I want to bugger that man stupid. Whoa. I'm like, I'm off. <laughs> also, it was earlier that uh, Zeke the Geek knew his stream and unmuted mine and apparently broadcast streaming topless. <laughs> this is the first words yeah, to come out. Yeah. <laughs> I've done that. And Me pantless. Too. Yeah. Streaming naked is the best. I know. I've done it multiple times. Yeah, if I've not got the camera on, I yeah. do. I stream a lot of time. I'll have little do nothing on. In a weird, do, I guess. You, you, you just sit there listening to someone. Time. See, here's the thing. A lot of people get really weirded out. Like, you sit around your host naked. It's like, yeah. Who because I'm at do? home. Yeah, it's I know. It's comfortable. It is. Who the you fuck doesn't do that? You feel so goddamn free. Mm-hmm. You know, uh, Jim, there was a guy that actually got social behavior warning because of the fact that he would walk around his house naked. What? What? Some, some family, it was, a woman, it was a woman and her daughter, cut through his garden, now cut through his garden, get to school quicker, and saw him naked in the kitchen, and complained while they were cutting through his garden. Oh, that the fucking pussy is, is just disgusting. It's, this is ridiculous. I'm giving it a shot, but... 
what is it? What is it? What's its flavor? What does it taste like? It doesn't have Did, a flavor. It just has you natural wanna, energy. Is it like I'm a? Try is it like yeah. ecto cooler or something? I don't know. There's guarana, Siberian ginseng, milk thistle, ginkgo <laughs> biloba. What the fuck is that? Shizandra. Bolo- I don't know what shizandra. Shiz- <laughs> what the fuck is this? Oh. Did you read really graveyard? That's really awesome. Yeah. Wait, 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 wait. Read off. Okay, after you had ginkgo biloba, which is a uh, one of those all natural, supposed little, supposed little mental enhancement. Shizandra. Thingies. I don't know. That sounds like that sounds. That sounds- Sounds like a female Sarsaparilla. African rapper. And then there's <laughs> Sarsaparilla. Sarsaparilla? No, it's Sar. Sarsaparilla. Huh. And then th- those are like the botanical extracts per can. Now the ingredients are sparkling water, sugar, white grape juice from concentrate, lime juice from concentrate, natural flavorings. What the fuck is that? Natural caffeine with botanical extracts. Botanical Oh, you know what it is? A, a, ref- uh, a refreshing lychee? Lychee? Oh, lychee! That's the taste. Have you ever had, like, a lychee nut? I have. I like those. Yeah, that's why... It, I guess now that I taste it, I can really taste the lychee flavor, but you can it's kind of weird, a carbonated version. Well, no, it tastes like it, it tastes very familiar. No pun intended, because I'm drinking pussy. But does it? Never mind. Go on. You started already. I was like, never mind. I was gonna make some sort of Go comment on. about about eating pussy. No, you, you've gone too far. You you dug the hole. Continue. But I'm 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 killing suckers in Final Fantasy V. Yeah, well, I'm downloading the secret world at four megabytes a second. That's awesome. Oh. I remember seeing a trailer for this like last year around this time. Oh my god. Upset on levers in Minecraft, as in like stuck to the ceiling. It's gonna be so awesome. It's gonna be perfect. Really? Oh nice. Apparently, yeah, I actually to that. tried doing that today, but I, I couldn't. I love that they gave the ender chests individual. Yeah. Each individual. And not yes. one. It's, it, Even though it's, it's that a... would have been a pretty cool way of giving stuff to people over long distance in a server. Well, it'll still work. With... Uh, no, you're right. But uh, I, I like that it's now a viable solution as a private chest. Like, just build an inner chest, and that's it. <laughs> that way, because it's it's a lot easier to understand than some, you know use the magic chest instead of we'll type slash lock chest or slash inventory access or some some something that's very esoteric and specific to each machine having something that works reasonably well in a default survival sense I think works pretty well. Am I making any sense at Who, all? Wait, who's Dinnerbone? Dinnerbone is Dinnerbone. He's one of the the bucket developers that was hired by Mojang. He one of the ones adding a lot of the good stuff. Yes, he's he's probably the one adding the most good stuff. Kind of, it's kind of good to have it from someone who's obviously like a fan of it and became yeah. who knows what he's doing, who became part of it, and now, like he's like, well, I know what people want. <laughs> Willing to listen and try and implement them. Mm-hmm. I'm sure he doesn't have free reign though. Uh, oh, obviously no. I hope they make the expert in enchanting. But, but then again, they seem pretty relaxed. They seem like they have a really relaxed atmosphere in Mojang. Yeah, I mean, I'm pretty sure you guys yeah. like, do whatever you like, want. Crazy relaxed. Uh-huh. <laughs> the like, secret world kind of freaks me out. In fact, I bet pants are optional at Mojang. Yeah, I hope so. Yeah, I'm, go- I'm going there. <laughs> I don't. I know nothing about uh, of me tearing chocolate open. I know nothing about the game game creation. But I'm going there. I'll just be like a furniture ornament that hangs in the corner without any pants on. <laughs> oh. oh no! Don't cry, Paz! But the secret world scares me. I don't know if I want to play it anymore. It's a scary game? No, it's. Just... I, I, I'm gonna sound like a tinfoil hat wearer, but it's like based on the Illuminati. That's just weird. Oh, this is that game that one of my friends, ah, uh, one of my friends told me about this, and it's going to be amazing, apparently. Uh, 
Oh. So, uh, when is it going to be released then? Let's see. Uh, there's going to be a beta weekend this weekend, I believe. Yeah, I'm looking at their website right now. Oh, that's pretty awesome. It's actually beta weekend three already. No classes or levels, total freedom of play. I don't know. And another, another reason why I don't want to play uh... it is it's fucking EA. Worst goddamn company in the world. Oh, it's by yeah. EA. I thought it was by. Yeah. Never mind. That was by Funcom. It is, but EA is just oh, public they're publishing era. it. It's okay. collab, yeah. yeah. Because you know, Anarchy Online was pretty good for its time. I didn't like Age of Conan, but a lot of people did. Oh, I'm so tired. So which one are you going to be joining? Are you going to be Illuminati or um, um, Dragon Clan or what? what's it all called again? I don't know. I wish you could just be a citizen and kill them. You'd be like a renegade. Oh yeah, here. Illuminati, Dragon or the Templars? I would totally go for Templar. What's, what are the free what are the free groups you can be? Illuminati, dragon, or Templar. What are the a dragon? What are the dragon. differences? I mean, I, I'm leaning towards dragon, but oh god, yeah. Are they like some sort Hell of no. Asian unified triad power? That's what I'm imagining. I don't know, but I would totally go for Templar because they are badass. But if I will ever play it, I will at least wait until the hype is over so that I'll know whether it's actually worth its money or not because I bet it's going to be fucking expensive. Here, let me see how the pre-order is. Well, it'll probably be normal price plus a monthly fee, right? Or is it FTP? F2P? F what do really? FTP. It's free to play? No, I just cracked you. I don't know. FTP sounds like, you know, like fuck the police or something. Well, <laughs> you can mean that too, yeah. Fuck the police! Fuck the popo! Have you guys seen the trailer for That's My Boy? No. Uh -uh. Whatever happened to Happy Madison? Their movies are just shit lately. Oh, that's the new Adam Sandler movie! Yeah, with um, Adam Sandberg, or Andy Sandberg, or whatever you want to call him. Uh, I think the problem is that Adam Sandler's just made a bunch of movies and now he's old and stuff. Creatively exhausted? <laughs> just Adam. old stuff. Uh, I think Adam Sandler's got a little bit left in him. Someone just needs to give him a good script. I mean, I think anything... Uh, uh, the last good movie I think I saw by him was Click. And Click was cute. Click. Click. Oh, that had Christopher Walken in yeah. it, didn't it? That was alright. That was kind of sad at the end, though. Yeah. Like, but... as it went on, I was like, oh my god, this film is taking a really it, sad it, turn. It did make me cry. <laughs> Last time I cried at a film, manly tears, mind you. They, they were tears. Of, the tears came down in the shape of fists when they went down my face. <laughs> they, uh, <laughs> <laughs> the most manly tears you ever see. It was The Green Mile. That was, oh. it. That was the last film that they made that to me. Oh, that's one of my favorite movies. I've actually, much for it, I've never honest. seen it. What? But that's, that's, oh my gosh. That story is by Stephen King. Yes, it is. And it's a great movie. Just like Shawshank Redemption, which also... Yes. No, Shawshank Redemption. Illuminati, 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 Illumin
gentler dive and, and get hey, the hey, 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 I don't know, it look like I, the I, I, I don't know, if it. we need text in here, because apparently he knows a lot about this, this, uh, this Tell game. Tell you that, even in the game, the Illuminati manipulate people. That's, That's fucking creepy. Right, well, just, I know, do, do, yeah. But then people are like, but why would they try and be open? Sorry. Well, I kind of believe in some conspiracy theories, only some. I, 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 I do not. I don't believe in conspiracy theories of that sort of way. Any conspiracy I know is that there's share. a conspiracy to kill sheep, and I'm trying to stop it. That's top, that's high stuff, that's high stuff, I shouldn't, I should be talking about that on a, on a stream, that's, people get killed for stuff like that. Mm -hmm. Well, isn't there some sort of irradiated island somewhere in Britain where they or they, where they tested uh, no, not irradiated. Or they tested like chemical stuff in World War Two, and it's just a couple sheep that are all like all diseased and stuff. I I've never heard that. <coughs> I've never heard that, and I don't know what you're talking about. Now be quiet. <laughs> <laughs> bollocks! 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 Quick! Quick! She's under it. She's under it. Get the man. Get the man. <laughs> And then you didn't hear anything then. I didn't hear anything at all. This is this is just something that I heard, and there's no no nothing's going on. Nothing at all. There's nothing to worry about. Uh, Uplink. I was talking about Uplink earlier. It's a it's a interesting sort of hacker game where you you know you have a computer interface, you crack into things, and it's pretty tense because of it's got that on Steam. Yeah, it's really good. I may I may try to stream that from a hotel if. Well, I'm out on Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday. On your mission. My mission. Your mission to rule the world. Yes. Let's see, Tornari says, nope, the secret world contains magic. I wanted something. No, not magic. I'll pass. Um. It's weird how magic always ends up being in an MMO. Like even Anarchy Online, which is in a, which is sci-fi and takes place in some sort of distant future, it has it has nano programs which are basically just magic by another name. It's like oh nanites. If you can't explain magic, it's it's nanites. Have you ever heard of the game called Huxley that was supposed to be like an FPS MMO? Yes, I want to play I, that. I'm so sad that that hasn't come out. What is it? Huxley. Huxley. Yeah, it looks really... It, it's been like four years since they've been talking about that. It's supposed to come out when, uh, when the orange box came out, actually. Yeah, they're really... Like, around the same time. Yeah, we haven't heard much on that lately. It could be that it's in some sort of terrible trouble. I, I want Hawken, though. Ooh, Hawken. Hawken. Is it a flock of sheep, or is it a herd of sheep? I can never remember a, this. Is it a flock? I'm pretty sure it's, it's a flock, isn't it? I don't know. I think it's a flock. I've had this before and I can never remember if it's a flock or... G-Man Harmon says, okay, it's either nanites, plasmids, or a wizard did it. Yeah. Flock. And wh what is it with, like, in sci-fi literature where people suddenly develop psychic abilities? Like, why, oh, why, why the hell does that happen? Because like the world's running out of ideas. Suddenly psychics. The bottle, there's a jar of ideas for films and TV and shows. <laughs> they just, they just and like reach in there, like, it's like how many jelly put, beans put, are in it? Yeah, but and but uh, a lot of people have taken some of the notes, so and never put them back in the jar. So there's only like about ten in there now. <laughs> so there's only ten ideas left for films. So it's going to get a lot of stuff. Lollipop, lollipop, lolly, lollipop. Who's who, which games are featured in the indie the game movie? Um, there is Braid. I know, I know Fez is in there. Fez is there. Oh, uh, yes. They they focus more on Braid, Fez, and uh, Super Meat. So much. I am so pissed off. It's not on anything but Xbox. Edmund right and now. Tommy are awesome. I want Fez. It looks amazing. It makes me want to touch Fuzzy and get dizzy. Oh man, that old. guy? Jesus, I feel for him. What guy? The creator of Fez. What happened to him? How long did years did it take for him to make it? <laughs> Too many. Oh yeah, I Too remember, many. I was excited for it from 2008, like when I saw the first trailer or something like that. 
is he like scrapped it like like uh, three times and he wasn't able to bring it out for a little bit because of like a lawsuit oh. being held over his head. Yeah, Pyro was just telling me that thing. And he was saying that, uh, you know, because of the hype over the couple years and if he brings it out and it fails, he's going to kill himself. He said that on film. It was... Horrifying, that's, that's like, yeah. that's just like crazy dedication though. Well, fuck, he like, spent this... like many, many years on that one game. No, I mean, it's like, they're, they're so, you know, they put everything into that, and if that doesn't go, then they've got nothing else. Well, it's just insane, because, you know, you, I was watching them, and, you know, they start off just just doing their regular stuff, but then they have to start meeting deadlines, and of course, as an indie developer, there's only, like, two of them to do every single thing, rather than a big team, you know? And you could just see them just getting worn out as time goes on. I'd like to see how, when, how Minecraft came along from, like, its first... Finish your sentence. Yeah. Oh, sorry. That was the push thing. It cut out again. Yeah. Sorry. I wouldn't even mind. I don't know what point that cut out at. Um. Wait. You wouldn't mind to see what? Oh, Minecraft. Uh, how that was made. See how that came oh, from actually, being created. Oh, actually, I may be able to help out with that. Let me find you something. Might take a while, but I know I've watched it, so. Oh, cool. I'll show you. Oh, pause. Have you seen this thing that um, Zisto's raging about on Twitter? This list of top 100 games? No. It's shit. It's oh, so bad. It's they Link got it the me. worst. Oh, uh, yeah, I will now. Hang on. I, I don't trust those. It's it's like. Oh, it's G4 uh, TV. Oh, that's fucking. It... <laughs> that's not even like. Uh, why is he even paying attention to that? Have you got have you got juice chat open? Juice chat? Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's right, I'll do it in Skype, it's alright. Well, that wasn't bad at all. Apparently it's one hour until Humby Humble Indie Bundle 5 ends, so make sure that you get all the necessary uh game slash gift codes for Never, I forced myself to buy those because most times I have like half the games yeah. in them. And there's like okay, there'll Moby. be a game there I want, but I'm like ugh. What? I'm putting a link in the chat. Okay. Um now this was probably the very first testing they did, or he did, because then back then it was just notch. Why is Pong number 100? This is Infamine, though, isn't it? Oh, oh, right, oh, sorry. This is Notch. Oh, yeah, his name's Nizoch. 2009. Very early test of an Infa, Infaminer clone and I'm working on. And he has on. a few more videos on his channel, and they're just hilarious. I love, I love the, I just love that description. It's just an early test, and at the end he says, if I ever get around to finishing it. <laughs> I'm yeah. just like... Yeah, you, you kind of did, and it kind of went pretty well. <laughs> yes. Okay, I'm not uh, even going to look through that. I fucking hate websites that make you change, or uh, open up new tabs just to go to the next one. It's, you, 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 you've, you saved yourself from raging. There's some, I mean... Well, Pong is number 100. That should be a lot higher, for sure. I mean, Braid's down, like, in, in the 96 area. <laughs> and Even though that was, like, you know, one of the, the highest rated Metacritic games... It, it was, it's, it's just above NBA uh, 2K11. Oh, that's how you should, no, no, that's what someone needs to do. Top 100 games, just go to the top 100 Metacritic things by score. And people will be like, yeah, I kind of agree. <laughs> Actually, let's look at Actually, that. Yeah. What is the, let's rank that. I need to know. Them hearts. Well, yeah, one, one, one problem with Metacritic is it's not going to do very well on older stuff because it's not going to be, they're not going to have reviews for really old stuff. Like, it's not going to have a review for Super Metroid. Yeah, I yeah I don't think that. I mean, Super Metroid would be would most definitely be in any top 100 somewhere. Yeah. I I I consider it maybe the best Super Nintendo game. <laughs> wow, pause. That is the most aggressive way I've received a gift ever. You're gonna watch it. You're gonna like it. Mm -hmm. He just he just sent me the movie right with the message. I fucking want your dick in and around my mouth. <laughs> nice. 
I love now the... Now that, ladies and gentlemen, is true love. Yes, they're, yeah, they're that so is, cute that together. Is. That's how it's done. They're so cute. Oh. Anyway, that is true um, love. if you count those 20 reviews, oh, Ocarina, Ocarina of Time is at the top. Mario Galaxy, Mario Galaxy 2, it's Grand Theft Auto 4. It's not the best game ever. It's a good game, but it's certainly not the best game ever made. Ocarina of Time? Yeah. <laughs> Um, it's a good game. I love it, but it's not the best game. I, I would agree I just, there. In my opinion, it is. But it is quite good, and at the time it came out, it made a huge, huge, huge impression. Yeah, it's it's very in, it's, it's it's influential a lot as well in the way I, I feel like in a lot of stuff. But it's just a big don't portion of my think... childhood was playing that game. So like it, like see that's the thing with all these, it's all opinionated. Yeah, well, but like a lot of it's like uh, what's what is it? when I feel like stuff like that, like with the older games. Oh yeah. I feel like it's nostalgia mixed with it, so like, love it, but sometimes your nostalgia for it kind of makes you think it's even better than it is. And I get that with some games. When I play them, I'm like, this isn't actually as wonderful See, the way game I base as I it on say that it is. is. You know, when you play it, you're like, damn, this, is, this still fucking holds up. I'm not sure if that's still nostalgia. I don't know. Oh, I, I don't I've know. gotten like nostalgia with, um,. There's a James Bond game that I just bought, and then I was like, how the fuck did I play this? And then I stopped streaming it. And I was like, man, I remember that game was awesome. Which game was that? Agent Under Fire. Oh, yeah. Agent Under Fire. Shit. That was awful. I liked it <laughs> as a kid. Oh, dear. That was bad. That was bad. Well, I mean, I, I remember be being older than almost everybody. Almost exactly everybody here. <laughs> 30. Uh, Bertie. I. Oh wait, can you hear that again? Bertie. What? I want to hear. I want to hear Lisa's growl. That was. That was. That was interesting. Anyway. Um. <laughs> uh. How old was I when that came out? Oh baby, I think I was sixteen. Sixteen sounds about right. And I remember being incredibly impressed by the game. And I don't think six, 16 is where nostalgia is less of an issue than, you know, later or earlier. Hmm? Huh? I mean, I think right. I think that it is a very good game, but it's not as good as Wind Waker. And Ocarina of Time? Yeah, I'd say Wind Waker is yeah, better. I, I, I definitely prefer... I actually love Twilight Princess. I know a lot of people hated it. Oh, I can I can stand it. I love Twilight the pacing Princess. on Twilight Princess is just so slow. I didn't like the wolf thing. I loved the game. I loved the style. <laughs> I just hated um, the mechanic. Just the main mechanic. Well, yeah, thing. like the style was beautiful. I, I don't know. I just didn't like the how it felt. Wind Waker was good. I loved Wind Waker. I haven't beat Wind Waker, Wind Waker, Waker and I'm looking horrible. for that because I want to stream that and beat well, it. What I love about just almost the most was it finally gave me the fight with Gandalf that I've always wanted. I, I mean, Wind Waker almost gave it to me. There was something with Wind Waker's final fight that I was like, it's good, but it's not exactly what I want with Gandalf. With you stab him in the fucking head, exactly with a sword. It, no, but you have a one-on-one -on -one fight, just you and him, in the middle of a field. It was just it, for me that was just like I was just like, oh my god, this is amazing. I literally got like hairs on the back of my neck when I was fighting him. It was just you and him in the middle of a field with this wind blowing. And then the way it ends, it was just so perfect. I absolutely loved that. That was why it, I loved it so much as well. It was just I didn't make it that bit. far. Uh, the beginning was so slow. It was like 20 hours before you get to the first dungeon, and then everything was just so badly paced. Fair enough. It's, it's a 10-hour game in a 40-hour game package. Mm, okay. Oh, my God. What? No. Oh, 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 At oh. the chat. And art. Aw, you and your monkeys. That's not a monkey, that's an otter. <laughs> that's a fucking monkey and a half. That is adorable. Looks like a Where the fuck dog. is Milby's eyes? It's an otter. I see how it is, Kirby. I see how it is. Milby, let's go. Give me one. Oh, he already got, yeah, Milby already got it for some fan art today. Give me one. <laughs> oh my gosh. Of the Colossus I is the best game it. ever, do I? It's, it is very adorable. Why do I have blue eyes, though? I have blue eyes! It's... It's anime eye type stuff. 
They're always blue. It's amazing. I love this. I love it so much. I I. It's giving me chicken box. <laughs> <laughs> it's killing me. <laughs> Die from cuteness. I'm gonna need to tweet this out. I don't know how. I already there. Twixed. I, I twixed it already. You can just retweet no, it. No, sorry, great. Sorry, Grave Joe. I haven't tried it yet. I, I will try it in a bit. I just need. I'm uh, Kirby says that he did it from your Minecraft skin. Oh, good. Are you eating a cookie? I want a cookie. What are you eating there? It looks delicious. Love a cookie. Damn it, I love a cookie. I like how I'm wearing a shirt with the arms so long that it, uh, um. The sleeves are going on it, and the cute little scarfy bow thing. It's adorable. Sega! Indeed, what am I eating in that picture? It's, um... What exactly am I eating there? Is it a Jaffa cake? No. Jesus fucking Christ! I am so it's in a, love okay. with this. It's a cookie. The Wind Waker to... is so expensive. How much is Wind Waker? Uh, on Amazon, seven used is seventy dollars. Is that is that the one Canadian. with uh, the original? Is that the one with the original uh, Ocarina of Time in it as well, though? Or do they all have that? I don't know. Because um, like the one I got, it's got Wind Waker and Ocarina of Time with the Master Quest thing. Yeah. Though I don't know. That is, uh, in fact, that was the first time Master Quest came out with that, wasn't it? Looks like Case Plus Disc on Amazon is going, I mean, buy it now is 40 bucks. Oh. See, see, part of the, the problem on Amazon is there are these, um, robots. Let's call them that. That uh, do bidding wars on items that are next exist, it actually exist, and the prices on these can burst out of control. This is why you see like ten thousand dollars shoelaces on Amazon occasionally. Ten thousand? Oh, there's some internet eco internet economy. There's some. Fun. There's some. Weird, well, they're, they're they're bidding on things that don't actually exist to try to make money. It's a really weird, partially scammy thing. And and when Amazon finds out about the them, they kick them out. But uh. Let's see. I mean, just go to a random uh, Amazon category. Let's go to... Wow, that is the freakiest comment I've ever seen on a YouTube video. I know where you live, Milby. I live in the same place as you. That's fucking terrifying. Wow, I hope I never run into that person. Fuck me, that would scare the crap out of me. <laughs> that's, that's fuck. Someone actually sent me an email and asked me, am I from exactly where I lived? And that terrified me. I was like, oh, fuck. <laughs> Why? it's such a small place where I live that it's more than likely that I will, that they could find me. Here or go. maybe it's just someone you've known all your life and you'd be like, oh, my God, it's so awesome that you actually watch my shit. They'd say, they'd know, if they knew who it was, then. Um... There we go. I mean, I pasted a link to something that robots have done. Yeah, they would say, they would say if they actually was someone I knew, genuinely knew. <laughs> um, Kirby... I don't think I downloaded it, but I did favorite it. Body Ooh. art pack. Well, look at the price on With that. With stencils. Yeah, it, it's just yeah. it's just what robots do. I just went to the arts and crafts category and sort of by price, and that was near the top. What the hell? Robots. Really? Yeah, they the the a, a pair of uh, things trying to make money got in a bidding war with each other to try and raise the price of something <laughs> that they don't actually have, and suddenly twenty four thousand dollars vinyl stencils. I love that. I love that. I love that two bots just in, just designed for that got into a competition against each other. Yes. I will outbid you. No, you won't. <laughs> Fuck you. And they start like trying to robo bid each other. Nexus is asking, how do they make money off of these $24,000 stencils? Um, well, no, normally they're supposed to just be slightly out of uh, whack, meaning slightly more expensive, and have someone buy it, and then they fulfill that if they can. <laughs> it's really oh weird. God.
Uh, pause. You know when you go, um, you know when you go to the well, to where the place where the end portal is on the server. Why are you so quiet? I'm not. He's, he's bromancing oh. on you. Um. He he just had some bad pussy. <laughs> and uh, <laughs> where where do you come back? Where do you come back out when you go through the when you go back out? If you go through the, ne the never portal, you come out next to the portal. When you go back through the never portal, you come out somewhere really random, like in the middle of nowhere, in the middle of the never. Where is that? Because I got completely lost and fell into pile of lava and died. But I just don't know where I was. I don't know. It, there was like a signpost, it was just like a really like eerie signpost that someone had put down, and I was just like, Ah, uh, I have no idea where I am. You went through the nether portal, or the end portal, you said? The end no, portal. The ne I didn't go through the end portal, I got the place where the end portal was, but I decided to go back, because I was just looking around. Oh. Um, and I went back for the portal, but it took me off to a different portal that I wasn't sure I was, and I got completely lost. <laughs> It happened today. I was trying to sort out a never portal for uh, leaving pause. I'm sorry to rub it in. And he's muted himself. And uh, I put it on a portal, and it, it took me to someone else's never portal. And I was, I was doing it with MC, and we had no idea where we were. We were in some base that I, neither one of us had ever seen before. <laughs> like, it, looked, it was like this really impressive castle that was not Beeves. Uh, it was crazy. I have no idea who it was. And there was this wall. It's from the Didion. precursors. What it, was it, was, it made no, of? It was something like this. It, it was, there was this wall with switches on it, with buttons on it. It was just a subsidian wall, and it had like seven buttons on it. And we were trying to work out if like there was some sort of like pattern to press the buttons that would open up a door or something. It was so weird. Do not discuss the Forerunner like, technology. Um... They are watching you at all moments. <laughs> I was like, it was like, it was like, it was like a proper adventure thing. I was like, I must discover the secret to this. And it wasn't anything that uh, either, well, no, not it wouldn't be Arcus, but um, Nebris did, because I know he's got like massive obsidian structures. No, no, no. This was just this small. It was a really big castle, but then there was, there was just this. It was weird. I've never seen this castle before on any video I've seen of it. I just know I you I I've, I've recorded it though and I, I need to put it out because I haven't put anything out in the last two days because I haven't been able to be busy. Because you but, were too drunk. Yeah, I, you, I just had, the graveyard been suggests before. that you found Hero Brian Castle. God, not find Hero Brian Castle. <laughs> I hope not. It was this really no, it wasn't a prank. This castle was not a prank. This was very very very. Um, <laughs> like, very Legit. incredibly well built castle. This was this looked like it took ages. Uh, I have no idea where I was though. It was like it was so weird. There was a big, big symbol actually on the wall that might we might know it was. There was a weird. It can look like a it can look like a J, but it was facing the wrong way. But it wasn't a J. Like an L. No, it was weird. It was it was really weird. I, it was it was like a. I don't and think it was a prank. in the Nether. No, no, no. This was, this was. I put Never Portal down to just go to a random right. place, but it took me to, it linked me to someone else's portal outside, mm -hmm. and it was like encased in wood. And we went there, and we were just like, "Where the hell is this place?" <laughs> and I work out. And then when I, when I actually did spawn properly, I spawned in a tree. Well, you know how you got in there. Portal in a tree. You know? hmm? It's they ate the others, and they just erase all history of them. <laughs> You made Michael sad. You bad, bad, bad sheep, you. Why have you not gone and visited Michael? Let's see, Kirby says, Do I got lost on your server once? And all I had were 128 signs and I had no build mode, so I wandered for miles leaving journals as, or, or signs as journals. I ended up in, an, in abandoned skyships and it was really spooky. That says something really spooky. <gasps> 128 signs, and it's just like I've been walking for days now. Well, I'm the new books are gonna be starve. awesome. They're gonna really help yes. out pranks. 
Monkey face. Oh, how so? You can lead people on mini adventures that get them even further pranked. Because signs have such uh, short limits, you can like actually write something long and be like, well, you've finally fallen into my trap. Don't be sure not to, you know, wander too far or something really bad could happen. And then you like direct them. That's already been done, though. And you have like, I mean, you can just put up. Whatever happened to that prank, though? Pause. You know this probably. What? The, the prank that was found with the signs. There were like, um, I think B found one in the nether. It was like oh, little stands. It wasn't a stands. prank. It was just like a little, little um. Uh, fuck also, is I it? found, oh, I found yeah. a hole. I found a. I found. I don't know what I found while I was digging my tunnel. I found like a staircase going up to a hole that was just. You fell down it, and it was just a single cobblestone block. Uh, it just hanging around over lava. It was very weird. But there was that looked like it was the leftovers from an old prank or something. Oh well, there's a lot of abandoned things, like projects that happen in Minecraft. It was weird. I, I I've got it all on recorded though, so it's a mystery. It's a mystery that I would love to solve. I I really would like to know what that wall was about. But you know what I'm talking about, right? Pause. Mm -hmm. Like it was these little, it was like a kind of a scavenger hunt type thing. Mm -hmm. I had to resolve the uh, whatever happened to that because I didn't see many videos of that at all. We kind of just gave up. <laughs> what happened to Michael. Team Nancy Drew? For fuck's sake, a bunch of quitters. T Team Nancy Drew. Did you want to give yourself like a, you couldn't even give yourself like an awesome awesome name? You could be you could have been like Team uh... the Hardly oh, Boys. Oh. It's raging oh, blue. God. Team Hardly Boys. <laughs> We've got it. It's the Hardly Boys. In <laughs> I'm the getting such a raging. Of the deuce. Such a raging clue over here. Oh my god, it's a clue. Uh, such a raging clue glue. <laughs> I was gonna. Sp I was so good. I was gonna spray clue glue all over the place. <laughs> so weird that episode. I've got a big raging clue, and it's pointing this way. I just follow your clue. Oh god. You just made her vomit a little bit. To eat? What? Well, when you're trying to eat? Ah, uh, see, like I think I've been complete. Like, I've watched uh, some really horrible, like, grizzly stuff on TV while just like sort of nomming down on a meal, and it's never bothered me. It's really weird. I don't know why. Yeah, I just bought Paul Green of Time so and much. Wind Waker. Hey! Woo! -woo. I'm actually um, eating some pasta that Ooh. my kid made. Is it is it the recipe that you sent me? Mm -mm. Oh. Oh, have you tried that yet? Not yet. Oh. No, my son made this. He decided to try something new. It's new. Especially it's new. new. It's fancy. <laughs> it's certainly new. Yes. I'm not sure about this. What's in it? Pasta. And? And, well, basically what he did was he made the sauce, like a tomato type sauce with, like, meat in it, like minced meat. And then he put the pasta in the sauce pan, and he just let it simmer for, like, hours. I don't know how long, but... Oh, so the yeah. pasta's all mushy. Yeah. I'm not I'm not I'm not crazy about it. Yeah, I mean, whenever I try to do a, that as a shortcut to and also to potentially get the um more of the sauce to sort of penetrate the noodles, you you, you really don't want it to be very long and f as far as time as in uh -huh. 15 minutes. Something like that. I'm not liking it so much, but I'm eating how, it how, just because he's you know, he did this. How is the the sauce, though? Because that shouldn't affect the quality the of the sauce. The sauce is great. Ah. Uh. Yeah. I, I'm, I, I just have a few more bites to go. 
But hey, at least my stomach will be filled. I don't know how to fill it. Wait. <laughs> <laughs> oh, really? What? <laughs> oh, shit. Giggle snort. Sorry, I was fighting off these psycho heads. Which are kind of gross, because it's like a tongue going through a face, going through a tongue. Ugh. It's like licking it from behind, and then licking through it. Yeah. It's giving uh, it a rim job. Ugh. Yes. <laughs> Do I don't want to eat this anymore. Why? Because it's gross. Then don't eat it. But it'll insult you. Well, if he wants to learn to be a chef, he must learn. Good that point. I, I am stopping this right now. He has to learn, you know, I mean, does he think it's good? He needs to learn that what. what it's, it's not so much what he thinks might be good, it's what is appealing to. The audience, or whatever you want to call it, the yes. customer. Yes, agree. So he needs to take a blow sometimes mm -hmm. by people telling him this is crap. Well, I mean, you said the sauce was good, so say the sauce was good, but the the, the noodles have been, you know, ended up being mushy. I'm feeling a little nauseous, actually. Oh, did he like add more than just? I don't know. Maybe it's just the thought of it. Alright, moving on. So, um, Final Fantasy V still? Yeah. For some reason, I'm able to pay, not pay attention to this game and still advance. <laughs> nice! Oh, it's Final Fantasy. You only have to focus on the fighting's happening anyway. I know, you just, you just like, even zombie you brain through just, it. Even then, you can just go like, Ugh. I'm pretty sure zombies can play this game and be like, ah, brain. Yeah. That's the one thing that <laughs> that I that, that annoys me about Final Fantasy is that I can accidentally like fall asleep while playing it because it, I can sort of like if I'm if I'm really like not on stream I'll be like like I haven't then, I haven't played this asleep. game since like '97 or '98 and I have no idea what's going on but I'm still moving forward. There's a there's a story but who fucking cares? This isn't one of the good ones as far as story goes. I do. I love the music in five, though. Oh yeah, I love cool. the music in five. The, it's like the last one that has a lot of happy themes. All the battle themes are so good. Yes, the uh, music is just really. It's really different in this one as well. One of the what is it? The when you get the dragon and fly around, the theme that plays during that, which I would normally <laughs> call the airship theme, but it's not actually an airship. It's a dragon. I just love that one. <laughs> exactly what? what God has said. What? That is exactly what I do. You walk, wake up, you wake, you fall asleep playing them, and you wake up running to a wall, or you're dead. Yeah, you wake up and you're like, what? And you like, you've just been running into a wall or walking into an enemy. Exactly what I do. I used to um on on like Final Fantasy X X. Well, either one or two, I'm not sure anymore, but there used to be a trick where you could, like, auto-level, if you like. And I, I actually tried this one night. You could, like, auto-level or auto-do something or collect items or something by, like, tying a, um, a rubber band on your controller to the left joystick and then, uh, and, like, attaching it to the right-hand side of the controller so that it gets pushed and pulled in the exact right position and you put another rubber band and you put that over the X key and then you put another like tape thingy and you put that on it was just complicated as fuck but it worked though so basically it's like a giant thing of bondage on your controller <laughs> yes yeah, the I boss thing is my controller Can I just, uh, lay down now and just, uh, I like to, like, lean my head against your lap, like so, and then I just, just watch you play like that. Can I do that? 
Sure, I'm, I'm okay with that. Okay. That guy just got bear hugged. Is my roof of in our chat here? Let's see. Kirby says, I fell asleep uh, playing Sonic Adventure and I woke up to Sonic attacking a chow in the corner. It's <laughs> great. Ooh, the Last of Us is officially coming out in 2013. What's going on? The Last of Us. That's the zombie the game, right? Uh, yeah, it's from Naughty Dog, the people who did uh, Oh my Uncharted. god, that one, the, one Uncharted, that I yeah. thought, the one I thought was Uncharted when they started playing the trailer. Yeah. Well, it's the same creators, right? It's Naughty yeah. Dog. I mean, I actually thought it was Uncharted. I was like, whoa, Nathan Drake got badass. What's going on here? <laughs> and then I was like, oh, it's a different game. It looked, the main character looks exactly the same. He actually looks like... I was like... Hang on, what is going on here? Why is he just stabbing people in the face? <laughs> what is this? I need to play Uncharted 3 on stream. I was going to do that. I started it when I was testing out my, um, when I got my Black Magic Intensity captured thingy. And, yeah, I need to do that on stream. It's going to be awesome. Ow. Okay. Which one? What, who? Uncharted 3. Because I've, pl I've played 1 and 2. Yeah, I like those games. They got I love the I just love the voice acting and the dialogue and stuff. They're just they're just full of polish. It's like a giant yeah. game all polished. Yeah, they're very well polished. There's there's just it's it the I just I love the writing in it as well. It's really it's well written. It's very it's very easy to just it, go through it's, it's enjoy like, it. It's like a good Indiana Jones movie. It's it's yeah, it's, it is. it's the first or the actually even the second movie is not that bad. It's a little gross outy, but yeah. It's not the fourth Indiana Jones movie. <laughs> Hey, the one with the one with Sean Connery is a good one. Just because it's got Sean Connery in. Yes. I'll see. He's can't do his voice. Yeah, it wasn't. At least it wasn't. Just do Decker Can. Hello, hello, <laughs> Sean Connery here. <laughs> That's actually pretty good. That's so weird. If I try and do him, I can't do him. <laughs> hello, Sean Connery here. Kirby is asking, what is Spanish Bombay moon. Sapphire like? It's gin. It's, uh... Oh, it's so good. It's delicious. Yeah, it's... it's... Oh, it's, it's... It's... Yeah, it's really... It comes in a blue bottle, but yeah. it's not blue. It's really just... It's really, uh... It's it's really saddening when you realize it's not actually blue. Well, I, in uh, America... It's gin. gin I was not... I was like, I was so like oh my god. Dry. I was like, Love oh it. my god, it's so blue. I was like, oh, it's... It's, no, it's not blue. I'm just really excited. Good though. I think next week I'm just gonna just drink on gin. You're just gonna never just... do gin shots. That's that gets you fucked up throughout the night. Gin I, I was too lazy to, to mix it, so I was just getting gin shots. Oh no, Ooh. no, no. <laughs> oh, it was it was a. Have you have you ever had um, possibly the worst gin ever? So strong at Ray and Nephews. Never even heard of it. Me either. Oh my god. That stuff is deadly. It's like eating I, a juniper tree. <laughs> oh, it's so it's like it's like sixty percent or something like that. Oh, it's so strong. It, no, Ugh. I did it. it I, I didn't know what it was. Someone brought it to is um. It was like a. It was back in uni. Someone brought it to like a flat pie. I'm gonna see what I mean, percentage. You've got to try this. Bombay sapphire is. I'll be right back. They were like, you've got to try this. So I tried it, and I went, mm, and then I puked straight away <laughs> into a McDonald's <laughs> cup. Into like, I was like, oh my god, give me that! Right into this McDonald's cup, and the guy was like, oh dude, I hadn't finished that. <laughs> I was like, I'm so sorry, but I'm so sorry. That was the worst thing. I, it literally went down and straight back up again. It's the worst thing I've ever tried. And the taste, oh, I couldn't get rid of the taste. So bad. Oh, and then we did it again. We did it again in a bar. Why would you bet. do it again if you threw up? Did it again in a bar. We didn't throw up this because man, we're doing we're taking the taking a dare. Manly man, because <laughs> we're idiots, basically. And we did it again. Fucking weird. Um, um it, it, we did it again, and me and my friend, we did it, and we're like, 
oh wow we just ra- we were in the toilets for about five minutes with our head underneath the tap just trying to get drink just like drinking water trying to get rid of the taste people were coming in going what are you doing we're like uh uh Ray and nephews uh, uh. oh it's horrible oh it's the worst worst drink ever is fear three ever. worth eight bucks Fake hmm. free fear three fear free fear free World. What was that game called again? Boss World or something else? Alright, I'm back. Oh, pause, what was it called? Fear. Welcome back. No, 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 no. The, the, the MMO you were playing before, I forgot the name of it. Was it Lost World the, or was it? The Secret World. Secret World, that's the one. Secret World. Um, so, Bombay Sapphire is 47%. You said that thing was like 70? Because in my uh, stash, the highest alcohol thing I have is 62%. It's some absinthe. Stairwell! Listen! Stairwell! Stairwell and get hammered! (laughs) (laughs) Stairwell and get fucked with me! Come on! (laughs) Like a Deckard Cain's drinking game. (laughs) Stairwell, let's just go fucking crazy! (laughs) <laughs> As every every time you, you, you identify an item, take a drink. <laughs> oh. G Man Herman says absence with group. I actually haven't had any really tro- trouble with absence. It's uh, it's not something you can drink quickly because it has such a strong anise flavor. What's that called in English? Absinthe. No, anus. 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 Okay. As in anus. Anus. Do you do you drink it traditionally? I drink yes. anus. With like a sugar cube. Yeah. The whole ritual. With holes. Got the, holes in the spoon. We've got the yeah. We've got uh, a set of anus or of uh, absinthe spoons. Anus fatty. I approve. Do I, I approve? I, I approve too. Where How'd are you I? get the secret world exactly? Where do you download it from? I don't want to. Whose dick did you suck to get that? <laughs> no, no one's. I just got, I got um, I got a YouTube inbox with ten beta codes. Ah, oh, see, this is. Remember, remember cave story. Yep. Remember cave. Story. Why do people let you do that stuff and not me? Well, I can't say anything yet. You're pause and pause, bitch. I'm with IGN now. Who said that? Oh no, I didn't hear it. Are you? There's nothing that happened there at all. <laughs> That's cool. That would explain the lollipop thing. I was going to ask you about that. Lollipop, lollipop, ooh, right. lollipop. How you like? How are you like? How are you lollipop. liking that game, by the way? Yeah, it's, it's, it's a lot of fun, wait, 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 wait. We're gonna we're gonna mute the stream here for a second. Hopefully.